We're approaching the closing stages now of the junior under 16 girls double skulls. This is the semi final, uh, first semi final of this race. And as we get towards the last few hundred meters, it is Headington School A who looked to be in the lead. In second place, Coleraine Girls School. But it's very, very tight. Uh, in the middle so we have a third place as it stands uh, St George's College uh, A and actually uh, Coleraine are taking a lead now uh, they're starting to pull through pushing towards the finish really saving what they've got for the end and they're cruising through Headington now uh, to go for that first place Headington are going to have to make a move now if they're going to do anything about it but I think it's going to be too late so lane five that's Coleraine uh, with an incredible uh, takeover of Headington and then that third place has gone to St George's yeah. College uh, followed, by, followed by Sir William Perkins School and then uh, coming up towards the finish now still rowing quite well together rowing their race Exeter and King's School Worcester but that was an incredible uh, finish by Corey. Well what was interesting is that um, Headington, if we're to believe the splits, had nine seconds at the first signal, first 500. Um, but they got rowed down by, by uh, Coleraine. Fantastic. I know they were rating a lot higher, and it is the semi, but it'll be interesting to see what happens in the A final. It's a cliche, but you've only got to be ahead at the finish.